Hi there and welcome back to Wizardry Tale of the Forsaken Land. I'm Byron and it's time to level up. As you entered the lodge, a female warrior was leaving. You fought many monsters yesterday, didn't you? I can tell that you have grown strong, building experience. I have gained many things. I will venture even further today. Take care. <coughs> Move. The female warrior glares at you. Do you have a problem with me? Do you actually have pride? Stop joking around. Your adventurers are all satisfied with just taking the treasure from the labyrinth. If you ask me, you're the same as kobolds scavenging for carcasses. Anything to refute? You just glare into her eyes. Then prove yourself. After whispering that, she exited the lodge. And we will actually rest. <coughs> so Ricardo now is a level 5 warrior. Is a level 5 ninja. I'm a level 5 priest. And Sarah is a level 5 priest too. She actually has more hit points than I have. <laughs> so that's amazing. Uh, when I play it is on my PS2, I actually have a, a different save there. I have way over 30 hit points right now. I guess there's a random element. I have the same stats though. The same stats. I started with the same stats. Well, it's easy to get. I always seem to pick that. So, let's actually go to the guild. Huh? A light action? The nervous girl was questioning the clerk wonderingly. But what's a light action? A new type of spell? You don't know? I just want to learn spells. Hmm, this is tough. I'll re register, register you anyways, though. The clerk was talking in a kind tone. I don't think you're cut out to be an adventurer. After thanking the clerk, the girl turned around. Your eyes meet. I, I'm sorry. The girl ran away embarrassed. Oh, poor little thing. <laughs> what an amusing girl. Next to you stood a knight dressed in splendid armor. I praise her for the courage she has, confronting the labyrinth without even knowing what an allied action is. From his appearance and behavior, he is most likely from his distinguished family. Allied actions are group skills. Teamwork can overcome anything. It is such a simple idea. This is no longer the same style of fighting as in the past. They not only look for courage and strength in a leader, but trust as well. A bond is formed only when there is a trusted leader. You seem to know the importance of AAs having people with you. I know the importance of AAs. In order to conquer the labyrinth, you need to take more precautions. Come back here after you develop more trust. When you do, you should be able to master your AAs. The man suppressed his law as he walked away. Okay, so we should register, register and change the class. I want to become a bishop. So, well, <coughs> I lose my level 2 and level 3 priest spells, but I well, get level 1 sorcerer spells instead. Yeah, and my equipment will be removed, I know. So, We have Dalok as well, who is a dwarf warrior. We have Creo, who is a gnomish sorcerer, and we have Carlo, that is a hobbit thief. And that's it. Why we could learn Rush? Cost two thousand. 
कुछ है क्या That's pretty much all we can learn right now, right? Yep. Well, fine. Let's head into the bar. <coughs> When you entered the tavern, a bunch of men approached you. You're Byron, right? We heard from Custer. He said you whooped Virgo's ass. You're great. People will beg to be in your party now. Man, it feels good. She attacks you just because your eyes meet. Look away and she throws a spell at you. You wouldn't believe all the troubles she's caused all of us adventurers. She's scarier than the demons there. I wanna make a toast to you. But be careful, Virgo is the kind to hold grudges. After hearing that, everyone in the tavern started speaking. But isn't that pretty amazing being hated by Virgo, man? Yeah, everyone hates Virgo, but it's hard to be hated by her. Ha ha ha, you're right. That just shows how much skills you have. So, now, you can get more jobs from the townspeople. We're counting on you. The entire tavern cheered and toasted. Okay, we could recruit. We have a warrior, Dalu, and a sorcerer or a thief. Let's take the sorcerer. Your party rank went down. The following AAs cannot be executed. Restrict, charge, rush and double slash. That sucks. I guess they don't trust me enough. Uh, I guess we'll have to change that. First of all, we change the party layout. Uh, formation thingy. Um, you go here, you go there. Yeah. Uh, do we have new quests? Yeah. Who's Lisa? The girl trotted toward the counter. You accepted my quest, right? Pixie's charm is a ceremony that fulfills love. I need a pixie's wing to perform that charm. She smiled embarrassingly as she said the charm. Her name is Lisa Cassandra. She's a medicine woman. I fell in love. It has been one-sided for many years. Well, you're a pretty one. His name is Radok. His family is the head of the Imperial Knights. Of course, he's a knight himself. He saved my life from a monster when I was still a student. It was love at first sight. Ever since then, I couldn't stop thinking about him. You can feel like this just thinking about someone you like. I feel like I forgot this feeling for a long time, like I was in a deep sleep. Lisa closed her eyes as she was moved by her own words. After a while, her face clouded and face clouded, and she looked down. An elite imperial knight and a nameless medicine man. It was never meant to be. She whispered in a faint. some courage? There's a legend I've heard about. You shine the light of a full moon and the pixie swing immersed in sweet nectar. Then you write the name of the person you like on it in rogue and bury it under a big tree. No, we're not in rogue. If you do, your feelings will reach the person you love. That's the charm. Okay. Help my boyfriend, Lydia. Wait! A woman you have never seen obstructed your path. Nice to meet you, I'm Lydia. I saw you're taking my quest. You probably already know this, but my boyfriend has started a stupid business in the labyrinth. 
I want him to quit, but he doesn't listen. We both used to be teachers at a school for bishops in this town. Hey, I'm a bishop now. But when the school was destroyed in the flash, he changed. He starts a dumb business, doesn't do well and quits. He's been repeating this loop. Now he's capturing monsters and selling them at his monster shop. It's so pathetic that I just can't stand it. Lydia sighed deeply. I know that it won't work and he'll just quit again. So I want to make him give it up now. But I don't know how to make him quit. I'll let you handle it, so please make him stop his monster shop. I'm so thankful that someone would take this pathetic job. Please keep this quest a secret from him. Okay, what else do we have? Train me to be a priest. Marie Maria. Or Maria, as we call her in German. Oh, it's the girl. A girl was staring at you. This is the one from the guild. As you turned your head, she turned red and began speaking. Um, uh, I, 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 I'm Maria Fredel. Maria Fredel, you've heard that name before. It's the client from the quest you just accepted. Um, I wanted to thank you. I heard that you accepted my insignificant quest. I want to become a priest, but I just was one. I used to go to a school, but it was destroyed in the flash. I don't have the skill to train in school here. I tried to go into the labyrinth, but it was too much for me. Please let me heal your paralysis. I wouldn't be in such a fix if I knew how to with spells. But I haven't learned anything yet except how to cure paralysis. Well, join my party, we could teach you, that's fine. You're quite safe, you get experience and everything works out. But please? Can you become paralyzed? That's an odd request. I'll be here, so when you do, please come back here. Okay, so if somebody becomes paralyzed, I guess I'll come back. And that's all the quests we have. So we leave and return because I have a pixie wing already in the inventory. brought a pixie's wing. Lisa took the pixie's wing and wrapped a handkerchief around it. It's just a charm, I know that, but this is all I have to rely on. I'm jealous of you, being able to take action. I have to go now. Tonight is a full moon, I must prepare the ceremony. You got the lapis on me. That is completed. Alrighty, anything new? No. Let's take a look at our items. There's another transfer potion. Oh, that's good. Okay, now I've mastered a cyber spell. Okay, if it's gray, you can't master it. Katana. I try to appraise it now that I'm a bishop. It can only be equipped by a samurai. It takes a lot of skill to handle, but inflicts big damage. Another pair of gauntlets. Okay. I guess we give them to Dalok. We can actually equip them. A 
So yeah. A chest plate. First of all the rope goes to me. Because the problem is that as a bishop I can no longer have a chain, see? So I, I guess I have to use the rope now. And a throwing knife since I'm in the second row. You have a chain. That's stupid. You should have played your warrior. Let's enter the shop. Oh, hi. A freshly made magic stone is just so pretty. The female thief Rui was gazing at a beautiful magic stone. Will you talk to her? Sure. She turned around when you spoke. Hmm? We meet again, huh? So, how's it going? I'm doing pretty good. See, I just got a new magic stone. Saying that, Ryu showed off the magic stone she was carrying. Magic stones are important to us adventurers. I mean, we can't use spells without them. Even sorcerers and priests need magic stones to learn new spells. When I was a sorcerer, I used a lot of magic stones to learn a lot of spells. I still get excited when I get a magic stone. Of course, now that I'm a thief, I can't learn any new spells. Ryu's eyes glittered. I just thought of something. I'll test you on your knowledge of magic stones. Is that okay? Aw, come on. She's kind of cute. I like her. Okay, question number one. How are magic stones made? Combining materials. Correct. A bit too easy, eh? Like you just said, magic stones are made by combining materials. You can get materials by beating monsters. Stuff like slime, goo, and pixies, wings are materials for magic stones. If you bring those to Vigor's shop right here, they'll combine them and make a magic stone. You smiled. Here's something that most people don't know. Magic stone making is influenced by the moon. Depending on the phases of the moon, the magic stone being made may mutate. Remember that it's most likely to mutate on a crimson moon. A brief lesson on the moon. The moon changes phases depending on the amount of time passed. The moon will change phases as you want the labyrinth. The phase of the moon is displayed next to the statues panel. Alright, next question. You can use magic stones to learn new spells, but there are classes but are there classes that can't learn spells? There are. Uh-huh, that's right. Thank heaven. If you didn't know that you'd be in big trouble. It's common sense that warriors can't learn spells, right? Thieves and ninjas can only master a certain amount of spells. Samurais and knights can use more spells, but they can't use level seven, the strongest level of spells. The best spell users are priests and sorcerers. A bishop can use the spells of both and a priest and a sorcerer, but the training they have to go through is pretty rough. Alright, next question. What is the use of a magic stone that has a spell you've already learned? You can power up a spell. Every time you use a magic stone, you can power up that spell. That's right, I see you understand that. Level up spells are incredibly powerful. It is important to use it. And that ends the quiz. Hey, you got them all right. You'll be a great adventurer. I'll guarantee it. As a prize, I'll give you this magic stone. I don't need that stone anymore. And re pull the magic stone from my pouch. You got a spleen stone. Fine. See you later. Okay, let's take a look at that stone. So, well, Q could learn it, I could learn it, okay. What uh, does that do? Causes one to fall in love, increases luck and raises one's strength against sleep. Can only be used by priest, bishop and sorcerer. So 
so luck goes up. I mean, I would give this to the ninja because he's, because he's opening all the chests, but can't equip it. So let's sell a few items. Nothing here. Helmet can not be used by thief, priest, bishop and sorcerer. You have a helmet, you have a helmet. Okay. We get 1100 gold for the katana. fun. So uh, if you take a look at the weapons now, the katana should actually... See here's the betraying sword. And the katana is in there too. The shuriken is a nice weapon. Uh, uh, the flail is a nice weapon too. It has two attacks. I can use by everyone except the thief, bishop and sorcerer. But uh, accuracy goes down by 15%. But maybe it's better than um, those n daggers that I use. So let's see. Um, this is kind of not only can only be used by warrior knight. What is M? I don't know. Samurai? Lord? I don't know. What is M? Nah, I don't want to buy that. Well, let's see. Who needs it? You have one? You have one? You can take it because his inventory is full. Fine. Let's make a few spells first. Yeah, the crater still needs a new one. Broken sword and broken sword. And um, Q doesn't have it, so he gets it. another um, hardy stone or maybe a heal. Heal is always useful.
So we could make another Barret Stone. That's the only thing we can make. Okay. Then I power up my spell. So, um, we could buy uh, some better armor for our warrior. Warrior and knights. You already have plate, you can't equip it. You could equip it. You can. Steel shield, you don't have a small steel shield. Well, this can't be used by priests, bishops, and sorcerers. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. That actually works. to you because you can't equip it. No, that doesn't work. Okay. I don't really think that we should actually hang on to those healing potions. They just clog up the inventory. Transfer potions are important. Getting potion not so much. Okay, well that was fun. <laughs> A whole video just in town. But in the next video we will return to the labyrinth. So thank you thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye!